Hi everyone, welcome back to another video and today we're going to be unboxing Pinot Jelly's latest series called Make a Wish. So without further ado, let us get to unboxing. The box design is really pretty, it's very Christmassy, and we have the cover page Pinot Jelly, which I believe is the most popular one out of all the designs. So turning over, we see 12 basic designs as per usual, but this time round we have two secrets. So the secret is 1 in 172 ratio and the super secret is 1 in 144, which is the usual probability of getting a secret for any other set. And in particular, I really like the super secret. It's called Chasing the Auroras, if I'm not wrong. And the colors are so pretty. But I never ever get secrets, so I don't think we will be seeing the secret today. Or the super secret. Would be awesome if we get it though. Box number one. And surprisingly, we don't have a Christmas-themed foil. I would think Pinot Jelly would design a more Christmassy themed foil, but it just looks like little gummy bears, little Pinot Jellies on the front. And it's the same on the flip side. First figure of the day is Lucky Elf. This is the card. Fun fact, this is actually my first time buying Pinot Jelly. So it's really a first time experience seeing how their figurines look like. He looks very cute. I love the apple green color that they chose for the elf. And if I'm not mistaken, I think most of the Pinot Jelly figurines have this sort of transparent, translucent-ish head. Usually some details on the inside or some accessories on the inside. So for this figurine, we have some glitter inside the head and he has a pair of green wings. He's wearing this orange striped white pants. And I think the best part about this figurine is the orange beanie. I think it looks very, very cute. So that's our first figurine. Box number two. I'm so happy because I wanted this one. This is called Gingerbread Man. And this is the card. He is so cute. He actually looks like a gingerbread man. He has a candy inside his head with a lot of glitter. I think most of the figurines in this set have glitter in the head. And he has this typical skin color of a gingerbread man. And he has purple eyes. That's quite a unique eye color for a gingerbread man. And he looks like he has these sort of um, gem icings on his shoulder. And he has a mini gingerbread man at his pocket. That's so cute. I think this one would be my favorite. I'm not sure if he'll be a popular one though. Box number three. This one feels a little bit heavier. This one is so cute. It's called Snowman Popsicle. This is the card. He really does look like a snowman to me. <laughs> but he's melting. And he has glitter in his head as well and an ice cream stick sticking out of his head that says Pino. The flavors on the front look like strawberry, vanilla, chocolate. I think he's a pretty popular one, I'm not too sure. I don't know, but I really love him. Fourth box. Fourth figurine is called Hungry Reindeer. This is the card. I really like him too. Why do they all look so good? Oh my goodness. I love this cranberry red that they use for his hands and feet. He has glitter in his head again and 
And I believe that is an apple inside. Is that why he's hungry? Because the food has gone to the head, not to the stomach? <laughs> and he's wearing this adorable knitwear that's orange, white and green in color. And he has reindeer horns with two little fur balls. Wow, he's cute! Oh, he has a little bell right in the middle of his shirt. This one is awesome. Box number five. We have Christmas stocking. This is the card. He is adorable! Look at his beanie! It's this awesome pastel blue. And he has a crescent moon inside his head. Look at what he's wearing. It looks like he's wearing these mittens. Kind of reminds me of elves for some reason. And he's wearing these very cute socks. Looks like it's kept with snow. And he's wearing an awesome jacket. Look, it's sort of like pearlescent, shiny sort of finishing. He is so cute. Can't stop looking at the beanie. It's so cute. Our very last box. Box number six. Last figurine of the day is Fruit Candy Cane. And the card looks like this. We have nice red and green. He has a candy cane stick sticking out of his head. It looks kind of scary, if you ask me. Turning him around, he has a gigantic lollipop bag. Or actually, it looks like a candy, not really a lollipop. He's wearing this nice maroon scarf that matches his pants. Ooh, he has pink eyes. That's so cute. He's super Christmassy. Really fits the theme. Alright guys, that is all for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. And if you're watching this during the festive season, I would like to wish everyone a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. But if not, then have a great day ahead and I will see you in my next video. Bye bye!